In the aftermath of World War I, the Institute of International Education was established with the belief that the world cannot achieve lasting peace without greater understanding between nations. With this belief in mind, J. William Fulbright helped to form the International Educational Exchange Program also known as the Fulbright Program. Michigan State University is a leader in Fulbright participation, and RAC professor Roger Bresnahan is MSU's Mr. Fulbright. I'm Roger Bresnahan. I am Mr. Fulbright here. I've uh, been at Michigan State since uh, 1978. In um, the last uh, year, I've been working in the Fulbright program at Michigan State. So basically what I do uh, is I promote the Fulbright um, and, and I also um, help people with their applications. I had a Fulbright early in my career and after I finished my PhD. In many ways, it gave direction to uh, uh, to my whole career after that, to my scholarship and my teaching and so forth. The Fulbright program is a U.S. government program. It uh, sends students and, and faculty um, to uh, more than 140 countries every year, about 1,500 students and about 800 faculty in, uh, in the major programs, and then there are several, several other smaller programs. Well, when I finished my PhD, my dissertation director said, well, you know, why don't you, why don't you apply for a Fulbright? Um, in the end, I, I went to the Philippines on a, on a Fulbright, and I spent my time um, in the coffee houses with the, with the writers. And I got to know their writing and, and also the relevance of their writing to uh, their, the political and, and economic and, and uh, social justice situations in that place at that time. Uh, and after I returned to the U.S. and got a job at Michigan State, uh, I got a grant to go back there and to uh, interview those same writers for in an oral history uh, mode. And I ended up with two books as a result of that. So it was a, it was a career builder in a lot of ways. You can assist an English teacher in the country. It's called an English teaching assistantship. You basically would be helping an English teacher, you know, preparing lesson plans, and sort of being a, um, a, a one-person seminar in, in American popular culture. You might have a research project that you want to do. There's a grad student program called the Doctoral Dissertation Research Abroad, DDRA, uh, and we currently have five um, MSU graduate students who are working on that. But I'd really like to look for uh, opportunities for the professional writing majors to work in a professional writing setting uh, within a foreign country, and I'm, I'm going to be looking for that. Michigan State is a leader uh, in, um, in bringing foreign Fulbrighters here to the United States and here to Michigan State, uh, both as, as students. And there are numerous faculty who come from other institutions in, in other countries and who come here to, to study. So the best way is to get in touch with me, right? I'm, um, uh, I have an office in the International Center and I have an office here in Bessie. It's like teaching. It's, it, every day is different, every, every student uh, is, is, is different and comes to you with different problems and has different, um, uh, uh, different abilities that, uh, that, that if, you, if, you can, if you can find the right key, you can open things up.